I welcome you to this commencement in Washburn University's 157th year. We are so glad to have the opportunity to come together to celebrate our graduates. This ceremony is being live streamed to those who are joining us remotely, and we have many faculty supporting their students remotely today as well. And now I invite you to please stand as the Washburn Wind Ensemble, under the direction of Dr. Tom Seddon, performs our national anthem. Thank you to Dr. Seddon and the Washburn Wind Ensemble. The music program is such an important part of Washburn, and we are so pleased that members of the Washburn Wind Ensemble are here with us today. Let's give them a round of applause. I'm delighted to introduce Shaden Haynes, president of the Washburn Student Government Association, who will introduce the platform party. Good evening. To the graduates, I say congratulations. To the friends and family here today and watching remotely, thank you for your support. To the faculty, thank you for your time and effort that you always give to create an exceptional education experience here at Washburn University. And now, it is my pleasure to introduce the platform party for today's ceremony. I ask that each member of the party stand when I call your name and remain standing. Dr. Judith McConnell Michelson, Emeritus Professor of Education and Grand Marshal of this evening's ceremony. Dr. Eric Grosbich, Vice President for Student Life. Ms. Ann Holting, President of the Alumni Association Board of Directors. 
Pres Professor Jeffrey Jackson, Interim Dean, School of Law. Dr. Jane Carpenter, Dean, School of Nursing. Dr. Zach Frank, Dean, School of Applied Studies. Dr. Dmitry Nosovov, Associate Dean of School of Business. Mr. John Nave, Board of Regents. Mr. Angel Romero, Board of Regents. Ms. Jennifer Sork, Board of Regents. Mr. Terry Beck, Board of Regents. Mr. John Dietrich, Vice Chair, Board of Regents. Ms. Shelley Bueller, Chair, Board of Regents. Dr. Laura Stevenson, Interim Vice President for Academic Affairs. And Mr. Marshall Meek, Interim President of Washburn University. Let's give them a round of applause. You may now be seated, thank you. Thank you, Shaden. We are here today to celebrate our graduates and their accomplishments. No one makes it to this point without the support of others. Our stands are filled today with family and friends who have supported these graduates. Other family and friends are celebrating their achievements from afar. And there are others who may not even be aware of the role that they played in helping our graduates to the finish line. I would like to, us to recognize a very special group of people who are key to our graduate success, our faculty. Faculty, please stand so that we can recognize you for your dedication to your discipline and to the success of our students. Thank you for the amazing work that you, do, that you do both in and outside of the classroom. The road to graduation from Washburn University offers undergraduate students not only an opportunity to earn a degree, but various additional experiences as well. Through the Washburn transformational experience, students grow in ways they did not know were previously possible. Students have the opportunity to participate in up to four different transformational experiences before graduation. These Washburn transformational experiences are described in your program. This evening, we would like to recognize the students who have completed one or more WTEs by asking them to stand. Please join me in recognizing the accomplishments of these students with a special round of applause. Thank you. As we continue to recognize our graduates this evening, there is another very special group we would like to acknowledge. You will see many students around Lee Arena this evening wearing a special stole that reads, First Gen. These students are the first in their family to receive a bachelor's degree. It is such an honor that you chose Washburn, and we are proud to call each of you an Ichabod. Please give a round of applause for all of our first-generation graduates today. We are honored to recognize a very special group of students, veterans. Would any veterans please stand? These students serve their country with honor and we are pleased to recognize them as part of the Washburn University family. Thank you for your service. And now it is my pleasure to introduce the president of Washburn University, Mr. Marshall Meek. Thank you, Dean Stevenson. And good evening, everyone, and welcome to Washburn University. It's an honor to be standing before you this evening, and let me tell you, from this vantage point, this is a really good-looking crowd. And I'm not just talking about the graduates who I can see right in front of me who have a lot of joy on their faces right now, but also friends and family up in the stands. You can tell by your faces that this is truly a joyous occasion. There are several things that it takes to get to this point, but one of those things is support. Support from family, support from friends, 
support from faculty and staff, support from your fellow students. As soon-to-be graduates, you've accomplished something very special, but make no mistake, you couldn't have done it alone. If you have someone in the room tonight who supported you, maybe up in the stands, or sitting beside you, or up in the front rows where the faculty are sitting, will you please take a minute to stand up where you are, find them in the crowd, and wave to them and tell them thank you from your seat? It's okay, you have permission, stand up. There you go. All right, good job. Passed another assignment. That was fun. One of the things I've noticed about working with Washburn alumni for eight years now is how often support, encouragement, and sacrifices of others are instrumental in their educational journeys. And today, you're joining their ranks. You're becoming a Washburn alumni. But let me be really clear about one thing. Despite support you may have received along the way, nobody could have taken this journey for you. Nobody could have achieved your education on your behalf. It's truly your accomplishment, and it will be yours for the rest of your life. This is an achievement that cannot be taken away from you. This will probably be a day you remember for the rest of your life. At least I hope it is. In life, you really only have a few days like this one where there's such a stark before and after. Today, you walked in here a student, and you'll walk out a graduate. It didn't really happen during this hour-long ceremony. It happened gradually over the past weeks, months, and even years. You face challenges like adjusting to campus life, balancing work and school, papers, group projects, quizzes, tests, and maybe more recently, finals. Just thinking about those things brings back anxious feelings for me. In fact, it's making my palms sweat just talking about it. I remember being a student is tough. It hasn't been that many years since I walked across this exact stage. And actually, I remember that day really well. I was seated, seated in about the sixth row on this side, right where you're sitting. Despite all the challenges of being a student, I hope you had some enjoyable experiences at Washburn, too. Hopefully, you met some new people, made some new friends, tried new things, stayed up too late on occasion, and maybe even had too much fun. You've changed, you've grown, and you've achieved success as a student. You faced a lot of important decisions in your life up to this point. And the fact that you're seated here today means that when faced with those decisions, you've made some really good choices. The biggest decisions are probably still ahead of you. What are you going to do with your Washburn education? Go to work, serve others, start a business, pursue another degree, support a family, You've made a series of great decisions that led to this day, but you're nowhere near done with the decision making. In fact, you're just beginning. You have a lot of decisions ahead that will shape your whole future. And going forward, you'll always have this valuable tool. And again, it's one that cannot be taken away from you. You'll have your Washburn education. Earlier, I mentioned things that I've learned working with Washburn alumni over the years. And there's one thing that stands out above all the others, and it's this. You can go anywhere with your Washburn education. I've seen it, and you can do anything. However you envision success in your life, your education will bring you one step closer to it. Your experience as a student has prepared you. Your education will open doors, and you'll be more prepared for what's on the other side. On behalf of Washburn University, congratulations to each and every one of you you make us all proud to be Ichabods. Thank you. We will now proceed to the conferring of graduate degrees. We ask that parents, relatives, and friends remain seated so as not to obstruct the graduates or the professional photographers. Please feel free to stand, clap, cheer, wave when your student walks across the stage. Will all candidates for a master's or doctoral degree please rise?
President Meek, those before you and in absentia are candidates for a doctoral degree or a master's degree. I am pleased to present to you now for the conferring of their degrees those who have completed the requirements and have been recommended by the faculty. Thank you, Dr. Stevenson. By the virtue of the authority vested in me by the Board of Regents of Washburn University, I hereby confer upon those who have completed the requirements the appropriate degree with all the honors, rights, privileges, and responsibilities pertaining thereto. Candidates for these degrees will be presented by their academic dean. Clarence Colton Tyler Alamand. <laughs> Whitney Alexandria Clum. Allison Taylor Crowder, cum laude. Clay Cajolis Denny. Elizabeth Feeney. Jackie Lynn Hanzuck. Alexandria Hawks. Hannah Elizabeth McCune, Dean's Honors. Amy Christina Medeiros, Magna Cum Laude. Zachary J. Smith, summa cum laude. President Meek, I present to you the candidates for the Doctorate of Nursing Practice. Allison McKenzie Allen. (laughs) 
Jennifer Ann Brewer. Paige Kaufman. Alexis June Elliott. <laughs> Hannah Marie Ederly. <laughs> Callie Marie Finley. Lisa Halloran Harris. Michelle Ann Hoisey. Christopher Wayne Miller. Bridget Ara Echu Obi. <laughs> Alexander Lee Overby. <laughs> Heather Nicole Roy. Tamara Elise White. President Meek, I present to you the candidates for the Masters of Arts, Masters of Criminal Justice, and Masters of Education degrees. Josie Carter, School of Applied Studies, Master of Arts, Human Services. Caitlin Roberts, School of Applied Studies, Master of Arts, Human Services. President Mick, I present to you the candidates for the Master of Accountancy and Master of Business Administration degrees. Bradley H. Koch.
Master of Business Administration, Amber D. Baker. Mary Catherine Bartell. Avaya Dungana. The master's degree represents more than 30 academic credit hours of advanced study beyond a bachelor's degree. The doctoral degree represents more than 90 academic credit hours of advanced study beyond a bachelor's degree. We are proud to welcome 16 Jewish doctorates, one master of laws, 13 doctor of nursing practice graduates, and 16 master's degree graduates as new alumni of Washburn University. Congratulations. Thanks to a generous gift to Washburn University by Erna and Gretchen Siberson, the Siberson Award has been established to honor the most deserving students selected from among the highest ranking members of the senior class in the undergraduate program at each commencement. Based on their outstanding academic performance, eight students have been selected as fall 2022 Siberson Award finalists. These students are truly exceptional and have been recognized by their faculty for their outstanding accomplishments. Additional information regarding each of their accomplishments can be found in your program. It is now my pleasure to introduce the Siberson Award finalists for the fall 2022 graduating class. If you are present, please stand as your name is called. Hannah Beamer from the College of Arts and Sciences. Hannah is graduating with a Bachelor of Education degree in Secondary English with a minor in Leadership Studies. Caitlin Dorman from the School of Nursing. Kate, Katie is graduating with a Bachelor of Science in Nursing, in nursing degree. Caitlin Criley in the College of Arts and Sciences. Caitlin is graduating with a Bachelor of Arts in English and a minor in Psychology. Trey LaRue, College of Arts and Sciences. Trey is graduating with a Bachelor of Arts majoring in Political Science and History with a minor in Philosophy. Misty Nichols, School of Applied Studies. Misty is graduating from, with a Bachelor's degree in Addiction Counseling with certificates in Trauma and Recovery and Person-Centered Case Management. Lauren Scott, School of Applied Studies. Lauren is graduating with a Bachelor of Science in Elementary Education. Chloe Taylor, College of Arts and Sciences. Chloe is graduating with a Bachelor of Arts degree in Psychology with a minor in Philosophy. Caden Van Landingham, School of Business. Caden is graduating with a Bachelor of Business Administration in Accounting and Finance. To these students and their families and friends, we extend our congratulations on your outstanding academic achievements.
The Siberson Award Committee recently met to review the credentials of the finalists and select recipient. One recipient has been chosen, and we, we will be making a public announcement very soon. We will now proceed to the conferring of undergraduate degrees. Will all candidates for a bachelor's degree or an associate's degree please rise? Those before you in in absentia are candidates for the bachelor or associate degrees. I am pleased to present to you now, for the conferring of their degrees, those who have completed the requirements and have been recommended by the faculty. Thank you, Dr. Stevenson. By virtue of the authority vested in me by the Board of Regents of Washburn University, I hereby confer upon those who have completed the requirements the appropriate degree with all of the honors, rights, privileges, and responsibilities pertaining thereto. Candidates for these degrees will be presented by their academic dean. President Meek, I present to you the candidates for the Bachelor of Applied Science, Bachelor of Criminal Justice, Bachelor of Science in Criminal Justice, Bachelor of Education, Bachelor of Health Science, Bachelor of Legal Studies, Associate of Arts, and Associate of Science degrees. Lindy Nicole Ellison. Julie Ann Coulterman, cum laude. Bridget Don McKenzie, Human Services, cum laude. Misty M. Nichols, summa cum laude. Bethany Renee Shoot, summa cum laude. Gordon Allen Smith III, summa cum laude. <laughs> Elenia Alonzo Olivias, Bachelor of Criminal Justice, magna cum laude. Dulce Maurice Elia, summa cum laude. <laughs> Bailey Ray Baker, Kuma Lane. Connor Michael Berry, summa cum laude. Jacob Frandridge, cum laude. Jordan Sue Feeniger, forensic investigation. Levi William Nathaniel Hammer, magna cum laude. Ashley Haslett. Okay. Michael James Schurig, cum laude. Quincy Grace Summers, Bachelor of Criminal Justice. Fletcher Turner, cum laude. Cody Wood. Forensic Investigation. Marianne Tay Barnes, Elementary Education, summa cum laude. <laughs> Ashley Plage Blendon, Elementary Education, summa cum laude. Carla Johanna Hickel, Elementary Education. <laughs> Emma Claire Holthouse, Elementary Education, summa cum laude. 
Julia Lee Hutchison, elementary education, cum laude. Shelby Randall Kutzi, Bachelor of Education. Brittany Ashton Micker, Elementary Education, Magna Cum Laude. Lauren Ashley Scott, Elementary Education, Summa Cum Laude. Morgan Murrell Butcher, Health Services Administration, Cum Laude. Tamara Monique Carter, Health Services Administration. Amanda Elizabeth Ann Katrina, Health Services Administration, Magna Cum Laude. Isabella Renee Minor, Health Services Administration, Summa Cum Laude. Alanda Rees Balsar, Bachelor of Integrated Studies. Emily Kate. Emily Kate Reyes Thompson, Bachelor of Health Science. Arlenia Marie Victorian, Bachelor of Health Science, Allied Health Honors. Larise Vergroen Williams, Health Services Administration, Summa Cum Laude. Savannah Kayleen Castorina, Bachelor of Legal Studies. Karini Emanuel, Bachelor of Criminal Justice. Jack David Hamilton, Bachelor of Legal Studies. <laughs> Nicole Bell, Associates of Arts Office Administration. Claire Griggs Cogwell, Associates of Arts, Culinary Arts. <laughs> Kelly Combs, Associate of Science. <laughs> Nijay Mee Hampton, Associate of Arts, Legal Studies. Janaja Marie Hampton. Janaja, thank you so much. Associate of Arts. Lynn Rizzo, Associate of Arts, Legal Studies. Yeah. Angelica. Angelica Renee Hansen, Associate of Arts. Yeah. Mia Isabella Jones, Associate of Arts. Haley Marie Vonderek, Associate of Arts. Laura Christine Wooster, Associate of Arts. President Meek, I present to you the candidates for the Bachelor of Business Administration degree. Bachelor of Business Administration, Nancy Akaria, <laughs> cum laude. Joshua M. Albertson, Skyla May Donnell. Richard Cody Dechant. Olivia Depew. Carlos Emmanuel.
Melissa Dawn Filken. JC Nicole Flutera. Bergen Reese Hufa, cum laude. Noah David Lainitz, summa cum laude. Holly McLeod, cum laude. Niels Maya. Jamison Daniel Phelps, magna cum laude. Ojashwi Rana, cum laude. Sam Breedy Regmi. Cameron A. Riley, cum laude. Isabel Claire Ryan, cum laude. Shiori Seiki, magna cum laude. Jared Lee Sharp. Shelby Ray Sutton, cum laude. Caden Quinn Van Landingham, summa cum laude. Ross Curtis Vincent. Christopher Robert Volker. Hannah Renee Willie Magna Cum Laude. President Meek, I present to you the candidates for the Bachelor of Science in Nursing degree. Brandon Lee Alvarez. Carla Nicole Artis, School of Nursing Scholar. Rose Aubert, cum laude. J.C. Barnes, summa cum laude, School of Nursing Scholar. Kennedy Boyles. Christopher Brent, School of Nursing Scholar. Hunter Browning. Claire Ann Kane, School of Nursing Scholar. Jaden Champlin. Haley Cole. Bethany Craig, magna cum laude, School of Nursing Scholar. Reagan Lynn Dalkey, cum laude. Hunter Jacob Dean. Riley Dean.
Caitlin Dorman, summa cum laude, School of Nursing Scholar. Sipperson Award finalist. Thought I missed something. Mercedes Igadi. Haley Michelle Fisher, magna cum laude, School of Nursing Honors. Natasha Fuentes. Heidi Elizabeth Fund, cum laude, School of Nursing Scholar. Maya Faye Gilbert, School of Nursing Scholar. Gabriela Ray Gonzalez. Annie Grammer, cum laude. Megan Marie Hackworth. Brendan Hansford. Angela Holthouse. Anna Huey, summa cum laude, School of Nursing Honors. Khalil Iman Izard. Savannah Jackson. Mora Keller, magnum cum laude, School of Nursing Scholar. Makara Lascaras. Kaylin Lopez. Isabel Marquez. Cassie Mays, magna cum laude, School of Nursing Scholar. Georgia Nikla McDaniel. Megan Meyer, cum laude. Madison K. Michaelis Dean. Lindsay Rose Modine, School of Nursing Scholar. Caitlin Alice Moore, cum laude. Peyton O'Donnell. Elizabeth Perry. Lindsay Loreen Price, cum laude. Bailey Ramsdale. Asha Danae Roney. China Marie Schlitz Ragsdale, cum laude. Braden Dean Schmidt. Kaylee Schwer. Corinne Alexa Searcy, magna cum laude, School of Nursing Scholar. Ciara Lachey Stallins. Jacob Van Wagner. Hallie Warren.
We are proud to welcome 149 bachelor degree graduates and 17 associate degree graduates as new alumni of Washburn University. Before concluding the ceremony, graduates, I remind you that this is a moment of transition. You entered Lee Arena as the final step in completing the stage in your educational journey as a Washburn University student. As you leave today, you begin your exciting future by joining thousands of proud Washburn University alumni. In that regard, it is now my pleasure to introduce Ann Holting, President of the Washburn University Alumni Association Board of Directors, who will share congratulations and a warm welcome to the Ichabod family. On behalf of the more than 50,000 Washburn alumni, I congratulate you on your graduation from Washburn University. You are joining the ranks of alumni from across the nation and around the world who, have all one thing, who all have one thing in common. We are Ichabods. Like them, you have developed a permanent and lasting relationship with Washburn University for the generation of Ichabods who will follow in your footsteps. Today, our graduation gift to you is a, an Ichabod alumni license plate. And on the license plate, you will find information about a special alumni association membership offer. You can join the Washburn Alumni Association for five years for $5. Simply go to the website on the postcard and join. Being a member of the Alumni Association is all of the fun of college without homework and tests. I invite you to get involved and be a part of the fun. Your fellow Washburn Ichabod alumni will welcome you with open arms. Throughout the rest of your life and as you travel around the world, the Alumni Association will keep you connected to Washburn University and to your classmates. The university's reputation is built on the successes of its graduates. We know you will go on to do great things and make us proud. We wish you happiness, good health, and prosperity. Congratulations and welcome to the Washburn Alumni Association. Thank you for recognizing these new alumni. Will all graduates please rise? Please ensure that your tassel is currently on the right side of your mortar board. As a symbol of your great achievement, please move the tassel from the right to the left side of your mortarboard to indicate your new status as college graduates and alumni. We conclude the fall 2022 commencement with the singing of the alma mater performed by Washburn music student Joseph Coddington. The words are located on the inside cover of your program. A song of the prairies wide, a song of a breeze of a college dear, a song. Washburn, Washburn, we love thee well. Ours is the joy, thy praise is well. With voices free, we'll sing of 
Thank you, Joseph. <laughs> Graduates, family, and friends, we at Washburn wish you the very best and brightest future. At this time, the ceremony is complete. The platform party will now exit, followed by the faculty and graduates. We would ask that following the recessional, you exit Lay Arena and meet your graduate at the southeast entrance of the building. Once again, congratulations and go Bods! <laughs>